The science is clear. The last decade has been warmer than any decade in the past 125,000 years. We are not on track for a sustainable future. The good news is, it's not too late to do something about it, and technologies are ready today. We know that renewables alone won't get us there. And still we neglect that the path to meeting the Paris Agreement looks like this. The largest piece in the short term, 40%, will come from energy efficiency improvements with technologies that are at our fingertips today. But what is energy efficiency? It is reusing energy. When our supermarkets cool our groceries, heat is generated. We can redirect the same heat to heat our homes, even neighborhoods. We can use heat from factories, from data centers, and from wastewater facilities the same way. Energy efficiency is about using smart technologies to run our buildings, infrastructure, and machines more efficiently. Today, most energy is used in our cities and buildings, in our factories and in transportation. And we use much more energy than we need. But it is not too late. If we put energy efficiency first, and if we do it now, we can still make it. By using our energy smarter, we can break the curve on energy demand. This means fewer power plants are needed, and instead, we can more quickly meet our goals for more renewable energy. Essentially, energy efficiency ensures that each watt generated from wind and solar can stretch further, drastically cutting the cost of the green transition, which is actually good business. This is not the future, this is now. The solutions are here, and most importantly, we need them to meet our climate goals. What are we waiting for? Let's not go back to what we had, but move forward to what we want, a green restart.